All right, dudes, welcome back to another Movie Monday. This week, I'm going to be talking about a film that kind of struck me by surprise, big time. It was another random pick I found on Tubi TV, and it's called Without Name from 2016. Um, apparently, its first appearance was in a Toronto Film Festival. Usually, that's a good sign. And honestly, this movie, like, after watching it, I kind of, like, had to, like, step back and be like, okay, that was deep. You know, very dark, atmospheric. It all takes place in the woods. So basically this guy gets told, hey, can you go and do this land survey out in the middle of nowhere? And he's like, sure, no problem. So he gets out there, sets up his gear and like everything about it, they make you feel so like, like it's stark. Is stark a good word for it? Everything is just creepy and eerie about these woods. Anyways, so he's doing his land surveying, and then, like, you see him, like, he's trying to get acquainted, like, with people in town. Again, it's a very small town, so there's, like, one local pub. You know, he ends up meeting somebody who lives, like, down the street from him in a trailer. And that guy starts opening up to him, telling him, yeah, you know, the guy who used to live in that house you're renting kind of went bananas. Like, he lost his mind. And he's like, well, what do you mean? And, you know, just kind of laughs it off. Oh, you know, he was really big into his mushrooms. So, like, here I am watching this movie, and I'm like, all right. It, you know when you put on a movie, and you're like, is this a spooky forest movie? Is it a cult movie? As soon as there's forests, I'm like, is there cults hiding in there? Is it cannibals? You know, at this point, is it ghosts? Is it witches? Is it fairies? Like, is it aliens? Like, is it just drugs? Anyways, so this movie... Right there, I was like, okay, is, is this all about, like, a crazy mushroom trip or something? Anyways, he gets back home and he starts reading more into these diaries that this guy kind of left around the house. And he writes so much about, like, these woods kind of, like, being alive and how the trees speak to him. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's really, like, it's a very interesting film. Anyways... So he's getting all into it. And then finally, he has some co-worker. Normally, he's, like, working in solitude or whatever. He has some co-worker come up and start helping him. And um, she's, like, the free spirit girl. And she's like, yeah, let's go hang out with your neighbor in the trailer. And, of course, that guy's like, I got mushrooms. If you guys are feeling crazy. And they take a mushroom trip together, the three of them. Guys, the cinematics as to how they film this trip. And it's one of those moments where it's, like, you know, you'll always have movies that rendition, like, a really bad trip, like, the way that looks, or, like, a really great trip, and how that looks. This one, it's, it's mystifying. It's, like, a weird, eerie, what's happening, and it's filmed so well. Like, I'm still, like, taken back a lot by it. It was very, very well done. Anyways, yeah, so they take this trip together. And uh, it, this is kind of like where the movie just ends up, you're like, what's happening? Because he sees a figure, like, kind of like a, a dude. Is it aliens? I don't know. Is, is this is just the drugs? I don't know. It's, seriously, guys, you have to see it. Like, this movie really, like, again, it impacted me. Like, when you watch something, you, like, have to stand back for a minute and, like, give yourself, like, a like, couple of, like, what just happened? And it was just... I love that. I love that about a film where I'm questioning, like, I'm still questioning it. And I love that. You know, don't give me everything like this and say, this is what it is. Thanks. No, I want to sit there and be like, all right, well, what was it? You know, it was really good. Anyways, you guys have to see it. This isn't a movie filled with gore or blood or guts. This is like a different kind of mind trip horror movie, if that makes any sense. Yeah, that makes sense. Anyways. All right, you guys. <laughs> Let me know what you think about this trippy one. I thought it was super good, honestly. Like, i have never heard of it before, and I feel like people need to hear about this movie just to experience it, because it's, it's creepy. It's eerie. And it's good. It's real good. All right. <laughs> if you guys are subscribed, yo, thank you so much. And those of you who are not, you get on it. Help a girl out and just enjoy the content. It's always silly movies, me painting or whatever, shenanigans, all that jazz. You guys have a wicked rest of your Monday evening and have a wicked week to come. We'll see you soon. Bye.